I know you were locked in the zone listening to Lil Wayne. I'm sure you had other great rap music on your playlist with an iPod Nano. That was the technology back in the day, like 10 years ago. Man, I couldn't believe I did that. My wind up setting my helmet like that. And it just put me in the zone just for like working out, you know. You yeah, know, it's, a different, it's a different kind of workout when you got music. Amen. Playing. So I said, you know what? Let me just try to put music in my helmet. So I wind up sliding the music in my helmet, Mark. It's like chewing gum, but you know, we got the mouthpieces in, so you can't chew, chew gum. So it was just like very, very relaxing. And at, at that point in my career, we just knew hand signals, you know, between me, Troy, and Ryan Clark, man. All we had to do was just look at each other, Mark, and we understood what each other was saying. So. We didn't have to talk. And that was the camaraderie. That was a brotherhood. And that was countless hours and countless days and countless reps to where we just figured it out. But all that started in practice. So um, me having some music in my helmet, I know I'm probably the only dude who ever did it in the history of football.